So Jordan, it's um, felt like a long time since we've been able to get sort of a full week's worth of training on, on the training pitch. It must have been nice just to have, as I say, the full week with no game to focus on, just to get a bit more used to what the manager's trying to implement. Yeah, it, is. it, it gives us a, a good opportunity, as you said, to get our heads down and try and focus in on a few more things that the manager's trying to implement, since he's not really had the chance to be here, because obviously the games have been thick and fast, but having this free week just means we can get the work in. And that as as well with the benefit, you know, it's it's a fairly hectic schedule in the in the championship a lot of the time. It's been mainly been Saturday, Tuesday sort of games. So as to sort of reiterate, to have that time and just to be able to focus on that it must be quite refreshing. Yeah, it is and I think uh, as you said, after the, the amount of games that we've we've played over the coming like well, the last month or so, it's it's been nice as I think as players as well just to to have just something else to focus on rather than just being games and adapting to to what the manager wants and just really getting it nailed down. You're someone who obviously you've been around for a while, you've played under a, a load of different managers and head coaches, you've had them change through seasons, that sort of thing. How have you sort of found the sort of the early days of, uh, of Liam Richardson being in the building? Yeah, been, it's been really good. I think um, that we, as, you, as you can tell by I think how organised we've been just throughout games. I think we've not only been organised. I think we've been we've been competitive, and I think that's what we've we've wanted. We've been in games. We've definitely been in games, and it's been really good to to have him in the building, Rob, as well. And it's it's for me personally, it's been, it's been really good. Yeah, it's, um, as you say, he's. Um He's, he's sort of put his faith in you as well. He's given you a, a nice run of, a run of starts. He's, he's been in your thinking. Have you sort of enjoyed that role up there, on, up top? It's either on your own or partnering somebody else. Yeah, it's, it's been. I mean, it's, it's always nice to play games and um, on a Saturday. So it's regardless of who it is, it's, it's always nice to play games. But as I said, he's, he's shown a lot of faith in me, and I'd like to think I'm repaying him with good performance at the moment. Obviously, the goals have been hard to come by at the moment, but. Is what it is. I'm pretty sure they'll they'll start coming. But as I said, it's been it's been brilliant for for me personally. You sort of mentioned that um, we have become harder to beat. I mean, a, a lot of our games have been really low margin. In particular, the the game against Middlesbrough, where it's really good away performance. Has the sort of the recent run of form has like given the lads a bit of confidence? I'd like to think so. I'd like to think even since the manager came in, it, it's given us a bit of confidence just to to go out there and be harder to beat but be organised in the same the same breath so it's been it's been good and, and as I said I think as you can tell by what we've been doing on the pitch as well you can see that we've been working hard on it. You saw, I, I read something earlier that it's been I think it's just come up to an anniversary of a year since you first signed here it's you know time flies how have you sort of reflected on your time at Rotherham United so far? Yeah it's, it's been it's been good as I said it's it's been tough at times which um, I'm sure you'll know being from Rotherham and, and stuff like that has been tough, but I think it, the the main thing about it is being resilient and I, I feel so that's what we've been doing and obviously staying fit, which is, as I said, for me at the moment, uh, my problems with my knees this year. So it's it's been good for me in, in regards to I've been available for most games and I've, I've, I've been effective in a lot of the games as well. So for me, it's been, it's been really good. And as I said, it's it's we know it's not going to be easy but we're, we're getting there. You speak about that word resilience, I mean you know people who look at the league table will see the sort of the gap between ourselves and safety, is it just a case at the moment of just taking it one game at a time and just seeing where that takes us because we have been putting points on the board recently. Yeah and that's, that, that's the main thing especially in this league is is if you if you don't get beat you just, you're getting points and that's you just kind of got to stack that up against each other and keep backing up every week. We know that there's going to be games we're going to get beat, uh, we're going to be drawing games, but as I said, it's, it's just getting the points, turning the losses into at least points, three points if we can nick it. So it's it's tough, but we, we kind of, we know our battles at the moment and it's it's one of them where we, we're picking our battles and we're, we're knowing which, what what to do. I think that, that was one of the manager's things when he came in, is, is showing us what he thinks we can do and where we can be. So that's kind of what we're striving for. There's a bit of a gap now between um, our next game in the league against Southampton 
Um, obviously one of the best teams in the division on a really long unbeaten run, but I guess it's a challenge that we've sort of got a relish. We did well when we went down to St Mary's earlier in the season as well. You got yourself on the score sheet. Yeah, it, uh, it's, we, we know it's going to be a tough game. The quality that they've got in their team, it, it, it's going to be tough. But as I said, I'd like to think that no team's had an easy game coming to our place this year. So it's, we're going to make it hard for them, definitely. But as I said, it's... It'll be interesting to say the least.